So I don't know if you've noticed, but a bunch of YouTubers way more popular than me have been playing Death Stranding, the most highly anticipated game of the year, and quite possibly the greatest game of the decade. Reviews everywhere have been calling it a walking simulator masterpiece, possibly one of the most important pieces of art since that Picasso guy. Unfortunately, I cannot play the game because I am broke and I cannot afford it. Luckily, due to my reliable sources, I have been able to procure a copy of this game, and I'm here to give you my analysis of this artistic masterpiece that one Hideo Kojima has brought to us today. So here we have a man on his motorcycle, and as you can see, this is very um, this is very allegorical to man's race against time, against um, humanity. And you see those clouds, the clouds are gray, so the gray represents the sadness that we as people go through. And here he's walking, he's driving through, he's driving through, let me see that, yeah, it's very reminiscent. Uh, Lindsay Wagner, I don't know who that is. And uh, we're going to get a reveal of who our character is. Oh look, it's uh, that guy from The Walking Dead. As you can see here, we got a bunch of birds falling, Ugh, they're covered in weird muck and they're dying clearly this is a metaphor for the environment because you know you gotta climate change is very real kids we gotta save the earth before it blows up and dies just like how that uh that greta that that greta kid wants us this is all wrong i shouldn't be up here how dare you greta wants us to save the planet so we should oh whoa what is that holy crap is that my mommy uh oh she's gone Okay. Oh, I, I, I think I killed her. All right, so let's we got finally got some gameplay going. Not a friggin' time. All right, so uh, let's see. Let's see if we can go this way. Let's see if we walk over here and see what happens. Oh, oh, wow. Ooh, I can scan things. Oh, cool. Oh, look at all this red shit. All right. Maybe if I go down here... And I mean, I was able to get this gameplay from very reliable sources, people. Trust me. Trust me. I'm an experienced professional. All right, I'm going to go this way. Uh, let's see. As you can see, there's a lot of walking in this game. I've heard many critics say this is like a walking simulator. And it's like, it's a, it's a metaphor for the trials and tribulations we go through as man. You know, uh, Jay-Z once said, power to the people. Or at least that's what I think he said. I'm just going to go and grab my picture. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, this lady, who I figured out is not my mother, and totally not my girlfriend or anything. That's weird. Sorry. Is telling me not to grab the picture because this weird thing, this really weird thing with hands, invisible, invisible man, is trying to kill us. But if we make no sudden movements, uh oh, okay, sorry, whoa, whoa, hey, 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 all right, you make no sudden movements, and it won't hear me. Yeah, that's how we're out. Oh, wait, 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 don't do, no, don't do that. That just makes it worse. All right, be cool, be cool. Be cool, we got this. I just shot myself. All right, so we have found ourselves in a station, a station of humanity, the Humanity Instrumentality Project. Thingy or whatever, I made that up. I'm so fucked up. It's Rage Cursing, I promise! Uh, I couldn't use any previous footage because it had copyrighted music, and if I had that copyrighted music, YouTube would kick my ass. So now we're gonna go into this little depository. Uh, this depository is an allegory for um, the various places in our life where we lay our head and 
we store our memories and our feelings because we, as a humanity, as a human race, we store our feelings like mailmen, like Amazon delivery boys. Jeff Bezos would be so proud. And oh, oh, who's that? What took you so long? It's not like <gasps> to come I know you. It's it's that chick from uh, uh that uh, the, the, one of the girls from Once Upon a Time Hollywood. She showed her feet. That's not very descriptive, but I know her. Is she my mommy? <laughs>